What is up, YouTube? Flourish at RC, and back with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team game. And here is a little squad update. You can see we got the NFL Draft Todd Gurley, man. This this card is amazing. 95 speed, 97 trucky, 95 agility. Man, this card is a beast. We're definitely going to have to try him out for a little bit. We're not going to sell Jeremy Hill just yet. And, of course, you also, you guys didn't see this, but we also got the NFL Moors Mike Ip. We had his base elite, but his base elite sucked in pass block. This one is a lot better, uh, including that 99 impact block. And then over on the defensive side, um, uh, we do have boss running lot, but at the moment that I'm making this lineup update, we did sell him. Uh, sorry about that. And, of course, we got the Sean Smith, and we also got... Trey Waynes, man. He is our new starting cornerback. Look at that. Six foot, 8, 98 speed, 96 zone coverage. Let's look at his catch. I did not take a look at his catch. He's got 85 catch, man. Amazing. So that's that's a little squad update for you guys. Let's get right. All right. What is up, guys? This is the debut of Todd Gurley and Trey Wayans here. This is also my wild card game with the playoffs. So let's get a pop it. I'm the fucking away team again, dude. Can I be the home team just once? I mean, just once. Is that too much to ask for or no? Anyways, guys, so my opponent, he was a bit of a rager. You guys might hear a little bit of it in um, I'm near the end. Uh, it starts in the, se in the second half. And look at this. That's not how we wanted to start the game. Jesus, dude. Second play of the game. We throw a pick. He's he's using a free Jameis Winston. Uh, who's his running back? I can't remember who his running back was. So again, rolling out the pocket. And look at that. Oh, he's barely, barely just barely going to find Mike Ditka. I can't remember exactly who he had. Um, I did not look at his lineup. So anyway, so again, Winston rolling out the pocket. And he's going to fumble. Ha, ha, Clinton Dix. Ha, ha, ha. Ha ha, Clinton Dix forces the fumble. So now we get the ball back. So now we're in good position here. Todd Gurley, look at him, man. So far, loving this card. He's a beast. I recommend you pick him up, man. I absolutely, I, I seriously, dude. I absolutely love this card, dude. Um, probably going to be our new running back for a long time to come. We don't know what's going to go on with Jeremy Hill. Jamal Charles will always be on our lineup because I love you, Jamal. You're my boy. Um, anyway, so our opponent was a bit of a rager, and he was not too happy. Um... He like he he kind of had like his mic down his throat, so you guys will kind of be able to hear what he says. Kind of not. He was just he was retarded and had no clue what he was talking about. Literally, he had no clue what he was talking about. <laughs> you know, uh, you know, and he's trying to like be you know. I mean, he's just one of those guys that's like, is this all you do? Is just sit at home and play Madden? That that's what everyone that's getting beat says. And Sean Smith with the huge pick there. But I'm serious, man. Everyone that plays this game, that's that's what they say. That's their excuse for losing. Oh, well, you just you play all the time. Your team's better than mine. You spend more money than I do. It's, I you know I think that I have debunked that theory because I had a 67 overall team and I beat someone who had like a 94 overall team. I mean, well, I didn't beat, they had to cheat to beat me, but you still get the point. I mean, if I can hang with someone with, with, with a 90, with a 90 plus overall team, and my team was a 67 overall, you know, I mean, you can kind of see that just because someone's team is better than yours doesn't mean that they're automatically going to win, you know, it's all about strategy, it's all about what you call, you know, it's all about, you know, so this guy, he had like no, his offense was horrible, his defense was horrible, and I mean, I guess, spoiler alert, he doesn't end up winning, um, but you know, and he was also saying, he was saying shit, like at the end of the game, he was like, you're doing exactly what I'm doing, so how can you say that, that I suck when, you know, when, uh, you know, when you're doing the same thing I'm doing, and I'm like, because dumbass, look at the scoreboard! Like, yeah, I'm rolling out the pocket, too, and I'm trying to bait the defenders downward so I can, you know, draw them off of, of the receiver. But I'm actually doing it, and you're not doing it. You know, I mean, and the reason why I was talking shit is he tries to, he tries to pause glitch me twice. And then he tries to say, I wasn't trying to pause glitch you. I was trying to look at your roster. And I'm like, then why did it? Then why did the game re resume right away? Because, you know, when someone tries to pause glitch you, what you want to do is you want to immediately uh, resume the game. And if you immediately resume the game, um, and if they try to pause gl glitch you, it won't let them um, cancel them trying to resume it. 
Um, because see what happens when you try to pause glitches, you pause it, and then uh, you quickly press A to resume the game, and then and then unpress A again, and then it glitches it. So if you immediately press A when someone pauses it, you'll avoid that. Uh, and you know, of course, he tried to say, "I was I was trying to look at your depth charts it's because you resumed it right away." No, you idiot! You paused it. It's me resuming it right away isn't going to affect it. And he, you know, um, he was just retarded. I mean, he just. I mean, I. And then I only talk shit to people if they try to pause glitch me. Uh, pretty much like if they do try to do any glitches, my. I mean, if they try to do any like underhanded things, um, I, I'm going to talk shit. You know, if, if if you try to pause glitch me, I'm going to talk shit on you. And look at this, Todd Gurley. What an amazing play for the touchdown. Uh, so now you're going to get to hear him rage a little bit. I'm still going to talk over it. But, I mean, yeah, I was talking shit to him. I mean, he tried to pause glitch me twice. And, you know, and he, he's also one of those guys that he's like, you know, he, he said, well, you kept talking, so I had to talk. And I'm like, no, you didn't. You could have got in a party chat. You could have just not plugged in your mic. You could have muted your television. If you have a headset, you could have just turned the the volume down on your headset like I don't get it people that you know like they you know like he was like talking shit he was like bagging on me for talking shit to him you know it's like you you do know that you didn't have to listen to me right it's like you could have gone to party chat and then he was like well that's just retarded you're retarded and I'm like what that makes no damn sense um I don't really I don't normally talk shit but I'm sorry but if you try to pause glitch me yeah I'm going to call you a fucking loser cuz that's what you are you're a loser like I mean you know like if you're just bad at the game like I really don't care about that it's just it's when people try to pause glitch me or when people showboat when I'm kicking their ass like they showboat into the end zone or dive into the end zone and I'm kicking their ass like dude like you know uh so anyway so look at this Todd look at him just cutting back but anyways I didn't intend to turn this into a rant video, but I was just saying, man, this kid, he just, he, he had no clue what he was saying. I mean, he was just pretty much just talking out of his ass. Um, so again, like I said, don't be that guy, okay? Don't be that guy that's like, you know, oh, you, you do nothing but sit in your basement and play video games. It's like, because, I mean... I, just, I love it when people on a video game, like if someone talks just to them in a video game, they immediately go to, per oh, you're a loser. You don't do anything. You live in your mom's basement. You don't have any life. You're a loser. You're fat. You're gay. You know, like, like me, if I talk shit to people, I talk shit on their, on their ability, on their skills in the game because that's all that matters because it's a video game. Like, I don't know this person face to face. I don't know their personal life. So why am I going to make personal comments about them when I don't know anything about them? So you just you just look stupid when you make comments like that, uh, you know. So, anyways, so again, he just gets mad, he gets upset, uh, you know. Uh, he ends up staying in the whole game, surprisingly, right here. He's saying, "Well, your team is better than mine, so how you know how do you expect me to do?" Blah blah blah. And I'm like, like that doesn't matter because I've faced teams that are, I mean, I had a 67 overall team and I faced 90 overall teams and still and still beat them. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this Madden 15 Ultimate Team um, rant. <laughs> um, I'll see you on the next one. I'm Fleur Shy. Have a great day. Peace out.